but not in that order, you understand? No, oh, no, it just so happens. We are looking for a captain and a crew to sail my ship, the Maid of Plywood, on the morning tide. Oh, well, in that case, ye need look no farther, for I be your man, Captain Hand, at your service, sir. Captain Hand? Hand? That's a strange name. How do you come to be called that? Oh, well, tis an interesting story, full of intrigue and woe at sea. Mainly it comes down to this. <laughs> Just a perfectly ordinary hand. Well, there's nothing ordinary about that. Does your hand make that noise when you put it up? <laughs> I was quite enjoying that. I might do it again. <laughs> They do say that power goes to your head, but I think power's gone to me and <laughs> Yes, anyway, should we get on with it? Let's get on with it. Yes. Well, you see, this hand has never been cut off, bitten off, chewed off, sawn off, and it has certainly never been replaced by an hook or any other sort of household implement. Arr. Okay, Captain, but we also need a couple of men as crew. Oh, well, in that case, it's just rather handy and convenient that two of my trusty crew are also in the Port of Hastings and they be looking for work. Well, now that sounds ideal. Yeah. Yes, 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 why not? Well, now, my ship, the Maid of Plywood, sails on the morning tide, as I think I mentioned. But you and your trusty crew can go aboard tonight and get everything ship shape and Bristol fashion for when we come aboard tomorrow morning. Hmm. Good day to you, sir. Good day. Ow! Ooh, little fish. Oh! Find that hand, Captain. <laughs> Does anyone have a look? <laughs> oh, forget that for now. Well, that was a lot simpler than I thought. Now, once we've set sail, I'm going to steal that map and then chuck them all overboard for the sharks! Aha! <laughs> Ah!